guys, nandito na order ko pa. Kain muna bago pumunta ng uh, press conference. I have this one. Tara. I have the pizza, I have the chicken and juice. So negative. Thank you, Sir Jimmy. Uh, another question? Yes, sir. Kindly state your name and please stay representing. Thank you. Good afternoon, ma'am and sirs. Uh, from Star Radio Catbalogan, Raul Villarde. Ma'am, ang, ang, ang concern ko lang regarding this one, kasi nakatatapat naman talaga to. Although we are negative, congratulations sa Eastern, Eastern Visayas. Um, pwede bang magkaroon tayo ng 24-7 na hotline? Kasi ma para maiwasan din natin ang mga fake news. Kasi pagkawas ng isang tanong hindi nasasagot ka agad, maraming nanganganap, nanganganap na kwento. So we need uh, the answers from the questions right away. Kagaya sa amin, sa Katbalogan, meron kumakalat na messages sa messengers na meron yung nag-positive sa Sanore Summer. So, it causes panic to the people at saka nagkakaroon ng ano yung takot ang tao. So, once we encounter this one, lalo na na kami media, ang um, gusto namin mangyari na ang um, hotline number always available 24-7. Do we have it? Kasi I tried to call last Saturday, walang sumasagot. Sir, uh, last Saturday, uh, no, last Friday, I was the one actually. Yeah. I asked uh, again on Saturday kasi kumakalap doon ang, uh, ang mga fake news. Uh, so I tried to, ano, to, to clarify kasi may program ako noon 4 to 6 o'clock. Ang question noong Friday, nasagot na yon. But when I tried to ask on Saturday, wala naman kasing sumasagot. So could, could we have... A uh, 24/7 hotline, na pweding tanungin or pweding tawagan. Okay, thank you, sir. Uh, um, that would be noted, no. Pero I just would like to clarify the the option hotline that uh, we gave mm -hmm. is actually para hain mga uh, hospitals or para hain mga tao mm -hmm. na may dalire ng refer ng pasyente. Mm -hmm. Okay, for for information like uh, uh, media information, no. Uh, the other phone number that was given by the HP mm -hmm. no, ang dapat dapat tawagan. Yeah, that is why I, I tried to call the offset kasi walang sumasagot dun sa isa. When I tried to call the other one, ginrefer ako sa lahat niya number. So, it's very confusing. Ayan. Once we are plugging the number, uh, we could give the right number na 24-7 ng mga tao pwedeng magtanong na lang directly towards you. Para kayo na mismong sasagot, hindi nadadaan sa amin na sa radio station. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. So, other question from our media? Yes, yes you, you can have my number, sir. Okay, thank you. Ah, uh, we We refer to the DOE sport official statement. Yung mga police po ba sa mga seaports and airports, nakamas po ba sila or? Ah, as, as the... Diyo is regional director said, hindi naman alarming yun na at saka wala pang kinital eh. Kasi it will cause panic kung ikaw na po. Kaya we always take the statement of the Diyo is before giving instructions. Okay, thank you so much. Maybe you can have a last question. So yan, nagkakaubusan tapos waray pa. Tapos, it's a trouble tao. Kaya waray lang, waray lang mas ilimusol pa mo ito. Na dapat, what news lang ito? Hindi nga liya na atin surgical mas is only good for 2 to 4 hours. Okay? Na talaga Wednesday, kasi yun ang... Okay, it's press conference. So, kakano na send in sa post to RIA? Um, the samples were sent actually this morning because uh, the first sample was February 1 kasi diba? Yeah, uh, Saturday. So we got the first sample. Then the second sample, kailangan kasi do had sample, no? Uh, 24 to 48 hours apart. No? So 24 hours after the first sample, we got the second sample yesterday. Tapos yan ang morning na mo niya din set to our idea. So hopefully, tomorrow, by the result, or Wednesday. So, yeah.
Exacto, y ella es por ti. So she will be discharging. 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 Nga still, Tacloban City is negative for uh, NCOV ARD virus or infection. Kung may agamang kita yan na aani nga PUI, ano po sana discharge na, it's now in the community and hopefully, sit na ganito kita kaya kaya nakalampas naman kita han quarantine uh, uh, period na 14 days prescribed. And after liwat siya na, na local, babae, uh, under ano pa ya, under observation up to Wednesday. up to Wednesday, but as of now, <laughs> sa bangin handlok hospital, as of now, asymptomatic ya, and hopefully, mag progress ya, na talagang up and about ya. So, we just pray na iniliwat na sa Limpaniboy, may din yan kaupon, is in monitoring, as of now, ang community and report, waray man ko no, baga baga makaraglog na sintomas. Okay, so, again, for the media people, thank you again. You are our mouthpiece. Mas doon na mo, iyo makukunbins, especially kung ma-attend ka mo din niya mo. So, bring with you our briefing na ginayad na na mo. So, ma-open ako doon pa. Okay, thank you so much.